Yo, it's from New York. Can't get no music, but what are you going to do? Let's do this. Cheers, buddy. bacon because oh god look at this look at this don't we clean don't we know how to clean First things first, we gotta make sure we got turkey. Oh, grilled chicken, that's what it was. I thought it was turkey, it was grilled chicken that whole time. Make sure we got cheese and bacon. Okay, people don't realize you do not need oil in a pan when you're frying bacon. Right? Do you, do you think you know why that is, guys? Can anyone tell me why you do not need oil? in the pan when you're making bacon. Wow, look at all this bread. Hold on guys, someone broke all this bread. Hold on a second, god damn it. All right, the answer is you do not need oil in the pan when you're frying bacon because the fat from the bacon will create all the lubrication that you need to fry your bacon. All right, so the first thing I like to do is look at how big the pan is width-wise. Right, the bacon is too long. All right, so what you want to do is you want to go ahead and cut that bacon. Take your slices of bacon you can lay them right into the pot, right into the pan, okay? Right. You can go ahead and fix it a little bit. My mom says when we use the stove, she's like, I'm like, Ma, what number do you have it on? She's like, 35. I'm like, 35? I'm like, you don't have it on 35. I said, you have it on 3.5. shrink dramatically so just go ahead and use as much of it as I can did you use all the bacon I'm like there was only uh, like five slices left Uncle Mike I guess grandpa used it all all right the last two pieces I'm actually gonna put in the microwave That's stupid, Mulex. If you were just going to put them in the microwave, why don't you just put it in the microwave to begin with? Uh, because bacon is better 
But there's even a, uh, is there a bacon button on here? Bacon, bacon, ground meats, veggie. No, so we're just gonna go cook time. We're gonna go uh, two minutes. Flip it after a minute. All right, we're gonna go ahead and put toast in the toaster. I got this toast, I picked out this toaster at Target. Me, my, my uncle and I went to Target. All right, that toaster was uh, $18.99 or something like that. Great toaster, so much better than the old one that we had. The old one we had sucked. Okay, this is great because when you turn it on, it has a digital readout, a digital readout for for for, for doneness. Okay. Go. I'm gonna go ahead and get our cheese open. Soon I'm gonna be cutting deli meats like this at my new job. bacon over. But be careful. Ow, oh, because it's hot as fuck. Okay. I thought it was turkey. It's not turkey, it's chicken. This is chicken. I thought it was turkey. But it's chicken. How do you know? Because it says right on the fucking paper. That's how I know. Okay. Alright. That bacon is done in the microwave. So what we do is we get some paper towel. Okay, we're going to put the bacon on the paper towel. Then we're going to let this bacon drip off here. All right, we're actually going to turn on the stove for us and just okay, I'm gonna put a paper towel down. Put this bacon on top. I'm gonna push down on that bacon. Okay. I like these things because see the bottom if you push the bottom in you push the bottom in it makes it open if you pull it out a little bit it won't open so I actually use it like that it makes it easier check the bottom of the bacon not ready yet but we're just gonna pull up on it so it doesn't stick so it doesn't stick that's what I said guys, that's why you don't need oil. Look at all that juice in there. That's created from the fat on the bacon, you see? That's why you do not need to add oil of any kind. Okay, get the mayo out. I like the mayo in this thing because you could squeeze it right out onto the sandwich. You don't have to spread it. It just, it, you do it in a nice layer or whatever and it's good to go. What else do we have in here that we could put on? Nothing. Just the bacon. You don't have any lettuce. Ooh. Look okay, what I have in the back. Tuna salad. These are delicious. I think I spoke about this before with you guys. It's ready to go. You spread it right onto the thing. This is out my waffle machine. My waffle maker. $40 Black Friday on sale for $10. $10. That waffle maker has already paid for itself fucking numerous fucking times already. It's a great waffle maker. Just an outstanding waffle maker. Outstanding waffle maker. You know how many waffles I made already with that fucking thing? That's great.
If I was, I might even make a waffle after the turkey, after the chicken sandwich. Uh, what was I gonna look to see if we had in here? Waffle mix I had, chicken sandwich I wanted to look. What the fuck was I about to look for? Waffle mix, I had a waffle, waffle was delicious. What the fuck was I gonna look for? I got the syrup. Uh, butter. Yeah. That special delicious butter I told you guys about I got with the canola oil. That's how much butter I have left in there. I'm telling you guys, next time you go to the store, two dollars. It's called Smart Balance Butter, right? A non-GMO canola oil blend. All right, canola. This is the kind of butter my uncle, my, my 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 grandfather likes. This butter shop, right? Whipped, salted. He also likes. Uh, oh, that's a different brand. But we also have the stick, and the sticks. We have Virginia ham. Oh, cream cheese. Philadelphia. Not so much the best cream cheese, all right, in New York, all right, it's a uniquely New York since 1927, is Tempty, Tempty cream cheese. Next time you get cream cheese, get the pink container, Tempty whipped cream cheese. You don't have to get the whipped, they have the regular, but the whip spreads easier. But I'm telling you guys, this stuff's great. March 5th. Good till March 5th. Definitely check this out. Give it a shot. All right? You want some good tasting cream cheese? That's where it's at, guys. When did I ever steal you steal you guys wrong? All right. Flip. Time to flip the bacon. Look at that. I gotta move the bacon that's not cooking so good over here and move the one that's cooking good over there. Delicious. Delicious. Absolutely delicious. Alright, so right now what I could do is the bacon's almost done, so I'll go ahead and push my bread in. Make sure I put it on number five. I think it goes up to seven, so number five is a good number. It automatically defaults back to four every time it pops up and you push it back down. It always goes back to four. There's no way to change that number. What is this? Bumblebee white chicken. Chunk and water. There's another thing I want to tell you guys. Whenever you get tuna in a can, make sure it always says tuna in water. Not tuna in oil. You want tuna in water. All right, it's a big, 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 big deal. All right, tuna in water. You can just eat right out of the can, right out of the can. Tuna in oil. I mean, you probably could, but it's fattening that way too. Tuna in water. Tuna in water. Nelly, yeah, you're such a big doggy. Look at the size of this dog. Look at the size of this dog. Look at the size of this dog. Such a big dog. Look at the size of this dog. Tail's a killer tail. Right, Lily? Lily, show the tail move, Lil. Lily, wait the tail. Wait the tail. You can't tell me. Oh, you're good, Lily. Let me get it.
poor right there. Uh, you poor. There you go. There you go. Come. Come right now. All right, sorry about before my phone died out. It died, but we're snowing. We're coming down now. We got snow. I just went to Wendy's and I had the nastiest lady ever. She was like a Chinese lady. She's very rude, no smile, no anything, just kind of dead fucking face. Okay, uh, don't mean to sound racist, but Chinese people are just nasty people. They're always nasty. They never smile or nothing. Then I get extra cheese for my salad like I always do. And they normally put it in here for me. But this time they fill up these fucking things, right? So I opened to check the bag and it fell and it opened and fell out in the bag and it spilled out all the cheese. So I said, excuse me. She comes to the window. I said, can I please get another one? And it opened up in the bag and she gives me a dirty fucking look. A dirty look she gives me. All right. I'm sorry I made you walk away from what you were doing, lady. Ooh, I'm so sorry. So I called the 800 number and I complained. I said someone, I said someone that's not nice or friendly shouldn't be working customer service. They should be in the back making the food and not dealing with the customer one on one. Nasty. Just fucking nasty. I can't stand people like that. Okay, and I don't really ever really complain. I don't really have time. To fucking do that and shit. Alright? But after she made that dirty face, that was the icing on the cake. So now my food's fucking cold. The burger and fry. Ice cold. Ice cold. Because I had to come home and complain. Okay? They can send me a fucking voucher for, for another free meal. Okay, that's bullshit. That's bullshit. If you were customer service, you better fucking act like it. Don't tell me my uncle is fucking... Oh, no, here it is. Okay. Oh, my God. Great. Five second fucking rule. Fucking five of my fries had to tip over. Hold on, guys. Fucking bullshit. Bullshit. I just can't stand rude people. Okay? I used to work customer service all the time. And no matter how much bad of a day you're having, you have to suck up to that customer. Okay? You have to suck up. Don't take it out. Look at this. And all the lettuce is fucking bad. All the lettuce is fucking bad. Unbelievable. I'm saying, you guys don't check your lettuce, because every time I get a salad, the lettuce is brown. Look at this. Look at this. Look at that. Bad. Bad. Hey, the other side is like that. I'm taking a fucking picture of it. And when I walk in there, I'm going to fucking show them. Okay, you guys have to check your lettuce. Check the lettuce before you're giving it to customers. People are paying for bad lettuce. Unbelievable. Well, half of this lettuce is bad too. Yeah. yeah. The other thing you should do after you eat is put, put your windshield wipers up. Oh, shit. It's stick. Let me go do that right now.
could have done it for me too, asshole. <laughs> You're right there. <laughs> I'm fucking with you. Uncle's like, you should put your wipers up on your truck. You're fucking right here. You can't put my wipers up for me. I gotta come back out and do it. Dude, look at a fucking road already. Look at this. Look at that. Look at that. Nice fluffy snow. This is play snow, boy. I wish I was a kid again right now. This is nice snow. We already got like a fucking almost half an inch already. That's crazy. Have an engine ready. Okay. This is gonna be a bad blizzard. Broil, but leave the door open like this when you broil to heat up fries because you don't want them to burn. It'll be literally one minute, minute and a half. That'll be done and ready to go. Come on, dude. Are you fucking kidding me? Okay. I got a lot of cheese this time. This cheese is the best on this file. There's something about this cheese that just tastes so good. Oh, the cheese is a little hard, too. I'll let them know that, too. Finish watching the episode of Criminal Minds. Mm -mm -mm. Here the French fries. French fries are done. Pink lemonade. Again, guys, crystal light, expensive. Do <clears throat> Weiler's light. You get eight packets for a dollar at the dollar store. I always say, some things you can get from the dollar store, and some things you can't. For example, tin foil from the dollar store sucks. Doesn't stay closed. Doesn't stick. Doesn't 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 stay closed. Doesn't you know? But, paper plates, styrofoam cups, you get 20 for a buck. 20 for a buck, guys. That's good shit. That's fucking five cents a cup. All right? And you can get are these fast frozen cheeseburgers. Pretty good. But again, remember I said about sodium? Anything that's cheap. 
590 million. Fucking grandfather. Well, not really my grandfather. He's not my mother's father. He's my grandmother's second husband. So, not my blood. Anyway, it's the fucking fourth time he came out for a snack after dinner. Okay? I'm trying to have my dinner now. Okay? My dinner. Okay? No one bothered him when he was eating dinner. In my way, going in the fridge. Can't stand that shit. Okay, another thing. When my uncle's cooking dinner, and there's dinner cooking on the stove, everyone else is waiting patiently to eat. Everyone's waiting nice and patiently. Big boy, okay? Little baby boy comes out here and has to get a fork, has to start sampling the meal. Sometimes he'll stand over and watch it cook. All right? Do you see anyone else eating? Is anyone else sneaking food and eating? Okay? Why do you get to do it? Okay? And then sometimes he'll take his fork, he'll put it right back into the fucking pot. Okay, that drives me fucking nuts. Okay? Take a little fucking dish and put a little on a dish if you want to eat. Don't put your dirty fucking fork back into the motherfucking pot. Okay? Don't spread your fucking germs everywhere. This old man down the hall. Okay, his favorite fucking phrase. Ay ay ay. Ay ay ay. Okay, everything. Is ay ay ay, ay ay ay. All right, he'll be laying down, watching TV. With his, with his Mickey Mouse fucking headphones on, right? Then he'll realize he wants a snack. Tummy's hungry. Ten minutes after dinner. Time for a snack. Time for a snack. He's laying down with his headphones on. Okay? He realizes... He realizes... That to get to the snack... He has to get out of the bed and walk to the kitchen. Alright? It instantly triggers it. It instantly, you know, ifs and buts, no breaks from the bathroom, nothing. That interrupts it. Alright? And makes him get right up. He gets up. He gets a fire. He said to him, fire. He Sorry about that. So he realizes he has to go to the kitchen to get the snack to satisfy that tu that hunger in his tummy. So it instantly triggers the first one of the evening. Maybe no, I'm sorry. <laughs> first one of the evening. Sorry, maybe about the hundredth. All right. Ay ay ay. Ay 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 ay. He's ay. Uh, that's what I call it. Ay ay ay. He's ay 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 Okay, even if it's only one ay ay ay, he's still ay 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 Because he has to get up, walk out the fucking area, and fucking that. Okay. Let's fucking that. Okay. Let's fucking that. Okay. Let's Alright, alright. 6 a.m., 6 10. I'm very tired today. But yeah, guys, I got yelling. Alright. That's how you know you got a fucking problem.
Oh, yeah, yeah. All right, that's not the only time he uses it. All right, ay, ay, ay. That's his favorite fucking phrase. All right, ay, ay, ay. All right. He gets the snack. Mission complete. All right, now he's walking from the kitchen back to his room, all right? So he gets a snack, comes out of the kitchen, and he has to walk down this hall here, all the way back to his room, all right? Now, during the trip, all right? During the trip, you know, during the trip to his room, you know, could take a day, week, few hours, the plane might be delayed, train might be delayed, all right? Whatever the case may be, when he's walking back to his room, okay? Ay, 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 Now this ay, ay, ay is louder than the ay, ay, ay to get the food, okay? I always look back, I'm like, what's the problem? What's the problem? What's the problem? No problem. No problem. Just realizes he had to use some energy to go get the, to, to go get the shot. Is that what the problem is? Who knows what the problem is at that point, okay? Who really knows what the problem is? I don't even know what the problem is. All, right, all I know is he's fucking sick. He's sick. All right, that's what he is. He's fucking sick. Ay, ay, ay. Everything's ay, ay, ay. Okay, I just heard it before I started this video. That's what made me make the video. All right, he does it when he's sleeping. He does it in his sleep. Well, that's what my mom says. That's what my mom said. He did it in his sleep. I think he does it as he wakes up from a sleep. And he's ay, ay, ay because he can't go back to bed. Or he's ay, ay, ay because he's really because he's fucking unfucking healthy as fuck. Doesn't give a flying fuck. Right? I just saw like a ghost go down this. I saw him. I saw his hand come and grip this wall here you know, like like this. Like I was standing there watching the wall. And I just saw a hand like this. And a body go down the hall. Could have been my tired imagination. But ay ay ay. So sometimes when he's ay 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 in I'll ay 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 because he's ay 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 and I'm doing it because I'm just so fucking fed up like with his fucking noises at this point. Right? The best thing for me to do is to fucking shut my door, put the earplugs in my fucking ear, alright, tune him out, and go to fucking sleep. Okay? Which I'm fucking about to do anyway. 9.15 in the morning. Remember we were talking about ay ay ay, snacky snacky. And that's the first thing he does. Didn't even brush his teeth. Up and eats. Up and eats. That's disgusting. Okay, you're swallowing all that gook in your mouth from the night before. Okay, I can't do anything until I brush my fucking teeth in the morning. Okay? That's why he'll never wake up to another female for the rest of his fucking life. Okay, no female wants to fucking... Like you see in the fucking movies, it's all bullshit. Mm. Oh, hey, baby. Um, so unrealistic, okay? So unrealistic how people wake up and the husband's getting ready for work and the wife wakes up and he kisses the wife. Right? It's fucking bullshit, 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 okay? And you know it's just acting, so you know they're fucking mouthwashed and brushed teeth before the fucking scene, right? But I'm just telling you, remember how we talked about his fucking, got a snack, snacky, snacky? Snacky, snacky, got a snack, snack, snack?
How we gotta lean over the pot and eat while it's cooking while everyone else will eat. Look at that. Hey, luckily I got two pieces of French toast before he came up because he took the rest out of the oven and that, and that was it. Didn't leave nothing for nobody else. Fucking King Tut. Fucking King fucking Tut just makes me disgusted. Disgusted. Sitting next to him before, and I see her away, trying to teach her not to beg for table food. Okay, and what did you just witness happen? Okay, fucking reaches over and gives her a piece of fucking French toast. Okay, moron. Okay, he sees me next to him, telling her to go away. He fucking hears it. He's not deaf. Then turns away and gives her fucking French toast. Okay, like in spite of me, in spite of me. And what I fucking did, shoot her away, give her a fucking French toast. The dog don't know if she's allowed to or she's not allowed to. If you got a moron fucking like that, if only you should fucking drop the fuck dead. Fucking unfucking believable. Fucking re fucking retard. Retard. Alright, guys, well, I'm ending the vlog here. I have, um,. What did I do? How many did I do? Two. Two vlogs. This is three vlogs today already. So that's it today. Uh, I haven't gone to sleep yet, so I'm probably going to lay down for a little bit. And that's really it. So uh, stay out of that blizzard. Alright? Have a good day. Peace.